I'm here with campaigners, local people and the King's Cross Railway Lands Group. We're handing in a petition signed by more than 11,000 people to the developers of King's Cross who are called Argent and they have cut the amount of affordable housing. They put an application to Camden Council so they could no longer afford to build the social housing that they promised and they reduced the number of social homes on the site by 21. We went upstairs just now, we uh, delivered the petition and Arjun sent their receptionist to take the petition off us. Um, they wouldn't send anybody who could give us a response, who could talk to us about the substantive issues involved. We need a response from them and we expect that to come very, very soon. 11,000 local people had signed a petition about what they were doing and they couldn't even be bothered to come out of their offices to come down and even speak to anyone. That they kind of hide behind their receptionist is, is tr it's a tragedy. Our best estimate of the shortfall is around about three million pounds that Argent would need to pay to give us the social housing to make up for the grants that have been lost from the government, which is the only reason they give for cutting the social housing. The flats in this area are going for more than a million pounds each at the moment, so that's less than three flats. And we think, you know, on a development this size, they can afford to pay the difference. But we are looking more closely at the numbers as well. We're not even sure that the numbers that they've given us are correct. And I'm seeking more clarification, so we'll keep you all posted about that via the petition, because you've signed it.